of a uh, female species, you know, well, you know, they this just if she's a bit moody, just <laughs> so easy, you know. She's a girl and she's the and it's like, well, you know, but what about us? You know? We uh if we're a bit horny, it's just uh, there's a way to, um, to, to deal with it, because it, it actually confuses the system uh, very much. Um, I remember sitting with the next, the next girlfriend, and uh, we had definitely uh, spent our time uh, and, you know, like, been through uh, whatever we needed to, to, to go through. But for whatever reason, we were hanging out. And that's the thing, it's sometimes it's just these chemicals sort of build up in your system. Um, and uh, you get this notion that uh, you're supposed to, um, when you're supposed to, your body starts telling you that you need to be with this person or whatever you need to, you know. Um, so I, I devised this sort of um, um, thing for sort of sorting out which ones were sort of, uh, um, should we say, decoys, um, and which ones were just chemical, and which ones had a sort of a sense of. Uh, something to them. And what it is, you just, if you ever find yourself in a moment, I mean, girls, you can try this as well, I'm not sure it might work for you as well, but if you ever find yourself in a moment um, where uh, you think you're attracted to somebody but you, you didn't think that you should be, but you think that you are, and you don't know whether it's a good thing to follow it up or not, uh, take a trip to the toilet or the nearest bathroom or something and uh, just uh, relieve yourself and come back. And if you sit down beside the person, <laughs> Afterwards, and you still feel something, uh, then you've got something uh, really, really uh, good going on. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs>